Behind every illness are intense and remarkable stories. Oh gosh, at first I was like, why me? We finally got to a specialist who did a blood test and said, I know what it is, you need to come in. And I was like, oh, that can't be good. And I said, so you're telling us this is a death sentence? And she said, yes. He was in such a rage that he knocked me down and he started to strangle me. Patients, their doctors and caregivers, all in a race against the clock, desperate to find something to help. It really is one of the most devastating neurologic disorders I've ever seen. I see other people do the things that I struggle with so much. Sometimes it's just hard to deal with people's stares and glares and comments. We would experience everything that a normal family would as long as we could. However, before there can be a pill, a therapy, or a machine that can help, there must be research. The progress over the last decade has been nothing short of astonishing. And I'm really hopeful that something will come through. Do I think it'll be easy? No. This is really acting as a bridge to a cure, to prevent long-term complications, short-term complications. If we are able to develop a therapy for one of these diseases, that would be effective in the other diseases. Between clinical trials in humans, the preclinical work in mice, at the bench, in test tubes, they will allow translation from bench to bedside. Bench to Bedside is the inspirational stories of people living with serious illness and the incredible biomedical research that could save their lives. So we're going to turn those neurons within the brain into micro factories of this enzyme. I'm confident that I can be happy in whatever stage of the disease that I'm in. I said this is quite unusual at your age to have this, but at the same time, that does not mean that life is over. My greatest hope of hope is that we're going to treat a patient and they're going to start being able to do things that they haven't been able to do in years. There is no winning or losing. There's only won and lost. Everything in between is to fight for. We know that with science and research and technology and with the amazing physicians and the work that many folks are doing, a cure is possible. Bench to Bedside, where science meets reality TV.